Hi guys, well I've had a lot of people asking me questions since I've uploaded my last video, so thank you very much for that. Um, but one thing I'm going to show you now is how to get your Arcade 1UP machine that's been modded with a Raspberry Pi 3B to show on two monitors. So you've got one monitor here, your original one, and also up at the top up there. This is especially handy if you want to do them mods where you've got your, uh, where you put another screen up the top or you've got a bigger screen so your mates can see it, or like me, if you've got a projector screen, if you want it on there as well. Uh, so sit back, enjoy. This is your short video, and I'll show you how to do it. So all you need for this mod is one of these very basic HDMI splitters. It's got one input and two outputs. It's very important you get one of these ones. The link to this one is in the description underneath. So let's crack open the back and see what we need to do. So here I am then. I've come around the back of the, uh, the, back of the arcade machine. I'm going to install the HDMI splitter that we've got to get this dual screen thing going. So the first thing you've got to do is find... The Raspberry Pi, and you'll see where the HDMI cable is originally plugged in. So I'm just going to unplug that and plug in the splitter. So the splitter goes in there, and then this goes into the end there. So it's still connected to the monitor, still connected to the monitor. So if I switch it on and test it, that'll all work absolutely fine. Yeah, that's absolutely works absolutely perfect. And I need so I've got my cable. A new HDMI cable to go in to come outside to where I need it to go. So I'm just going to plug it in here. There we go. And when I put the back on, that is just going to sit around the back there and quite happily plug into where I need it to plug into. So we'll get the back put on and I will see what we can get it plugged up into. So let's get it switched back on now and see what it does now. It's all hooked up. I've hooked it up to my capture card. Uh, which is running into my PC, and I've run another uh, HDMI cable into my PC, so we can see uh, if this works. So I'll just wait for emulation station to load up. So we've got the Amiga on there, it's all working on there. And then if we look at the other monitor, there we have it, it's been perfectly picked up on my capture card. So whatever's being played on there, is being shown on my card, so I can now pick it up. It also works if you plug this into a HDMI a television so you can have double screens running so i'll show you a few pictures now of things i've seen on the facebook arcade one up set arcade one up page uh that shows people using the double screens and the big screens and they've made some fantastic some really really good efforts with modern their arcade one up machine especially with the cabinets that go above the screen above the actual arcade uh so i'll maybe look at doing that at some point but that's how you do it guys it's easy as that you buy the you buy the hdmi splitter that we've got you plug it in the back you plug the other side into a HDMI, uh, HDMI port on a telly or a monitor, or like I'm doing here, running it through my uh, computer. And then you go from there, and it runs absolutely fine. So there you go, there's a screen saver. There's a show, my screen saver runs through the games it's installed, so Adam's Family Values. And Adam's Family Values on there. Easy. So guys, thanks for watching this. It's been a very brief introduction video on how to do a cut and how to do a dual monitors on your arcade one up machine but uh thanks for watching and i'll see you next time